Hello everyone, my name is Messina145 and thank you for coming and watching my very first commentary. I'm pretty excited to do this. I'm commentating over a Gears of War 3 gameplay. I'm playing Team Deathmatch on Trenches. And to tell you a little bit about the gameplay, I go 12-1 and 1 in the two rounds. The first round I go 4-1 and 1, and the second round I go 8-0. Uh, the first round for me was a little boring because I was actually playing with some pretty good randoms and we just made quick work of the Locust. And I go 4-1, and one, and it's just mostly me running around. I was running around a lot because I was trying to flank them and get behind them. And I was just trying to see if I can catch as many off guard as I can. I only catch four of them off guard, but... What's fun about this round was the way I ended it. Was there was, They only had two guys left, and I used the Retro Lancer and I Retro Charged them. And I, I killed them with the, the Retro Charge. Both of them end the round. Not at the same time, but at different times. Excuse me, sorry. But yeah, I'm using the Retro Lancer because I wanted to get 100 kills with it so I can get the medals and ribbons. And I think it's actually this game I actually do get the 100 kills. So I can go on to the Hammer Burst now and start using that one. But since it's my first commentary, I would like to talk about the gameplay, but I mostly want to introduce myself, um, tell you a little bit about me, what I'm studying, and then um, I want to talk about my YouTube channel, how I got into video games, and um, kind of how I got into YouTube. So to introduce myself, my name is Anthony Messina. I live in Chicago, Illinois, but I go to college in Wisconsin. And right now I am in school right now, so I guess technically I live here for nine months out of year. But um, so the school I go to is I go to Milwaukee School of Engineering. So if you can get from that, I'm studying to be an engineer. More specifically, I'm studying to be a mechanical engineer. Um, and for mechanical engineers, what we do is, um, well, here is we learn about the design process, manufacturing processes. Uh, one of my classes actually is thermodynamics, so we learn a little bit about thermo, uh, material sciences, uh, uh, just this basic study of engineering uh, and mechanical engineering. So um, I wanted to talk about that was because that's a big reason why I don't post a lot and why I want to post a lot, but the workload here is really Enemy heavy. Time. I'm in my junior year, so we do have harder classes. We have lab reports every week, and uh, we have homework in like the majority of our classes, so we have to get that done. So, and the homework, it's not like it just takes a couple hours to do. It, it takes multiple days to do, especially the labs, and then the lab reports themselves. So, that's just a little bit about my school, and about me, um, I just turned 21. I had my birthday on October 11th, which was Tuesday, which was, was today, Sunday, so that was, what, six days ago? And um, yeah, my roommate just came out of his room. He's like, what are you doing? <laughs> Trying to do a commentary here, Greg. <laughs> but yeah, um, I have multiple roommates. He's <laughs> making things at me right now. I'm trying to do something, Greg. So <laughs> I spear that guy to end the round. But anyway, yeah, um, it's fun here. Um, my roommates are a blast. They're cool guys. So um, I um, live in this one dorm called Regents. It's um. Kind of like a house, but it's well, it's not really like a house. Just think of it as like a crappy large apartment. <laughs> we have a common room and then two double rooms, so but it's nice. Um, I like who I'm living with, we have a great time, and we're all mechanical engineers, so we all help each other out. And it's nice, especially here, you're gonna have some trouble and you gotta help have people to help you out sometimes. Crack them out, but it's challenging, rewarding. I have a great time here, and um. Like I said, I just turned 21, um, so on my 21st birthday, I couldn't really do anything. So the next day, Wednesday, I actually had a test. So really the only thing we did was we went out, had a few beers, and then came back. But the funny thing about that is um, the test the next day actually got canceled in the morning. <laughs> so I was like, oh, are you kidding me? I could have stayed out and had had a few more beers, but it's okay. Um, I went out last night and for my, you know, kind of like a little continuation of the birthday. So we went out and to where I work, um, we went out and um, had a few beers. Um, I work at uh, a bowling alley slash bar, so I wanted to go to my bar where I work so I could get a discount. Drinks, drinks can be expensive, but I get a dollar discount, which is nice. So like I said, we had a few beers and then we came back and um, I got this gameplay. So I just wanted to commentate over it and let you know a little bit about myself. But now on to YouTube. Um, I started playing video games, well I've always had an Xbox in high school, but I hardly ever played because 
I was in multiple sports. I played crack, track, crack. cross country. Well, I ran track and cross country. I didn't play, but I bowled in high school. So, and I've been I've been bowling for a really long time. I've, let's see, I've been bowling since I was eight years old. So, 13 years I've been bowling. So, I think I'm pretty good. But Incoming smoke. I have a fun time doing it. But here at this school, I can't really bowl. And the fun thing about that is, I actually didn't make the team, which was kind of weird. But what are, what are you gonna do? Oh yeah. Um, but yeah. So for YouTube, um, I started in when I came here in college. Um, I met some people when they had Xbox Live, and I didn't have Xbox Live yet. And they're like, "Well, are you gonna play Xbox with us?" And I was like, "Well, I don't have Live." So we went to the mall, got me some points, and I got Live, and I just started playing with them. And the first game I was playing was Call of Duty: Modern Warfare. And I thought I had so much fun playing that game. And then MW2 came out, and I started playing that, and that's when I actually started sniping, and just to say, that's what I enjoyed the most. And then Call of Duty Black Ops came out, and I have to give it up to them, because that's what got me started in YouTube. The rendering system that they had um, allowed me to post up on my YouTube channel, and I just started making clips little clips and posting up because they can only be 30 seconds long and then posting up on my YouTube channel and then once I got a bunch of them I made some montages and the cool thing is the one really cool thing that um, got me to have all you guys to subscribe to me was um, I was playing one night with my buddies and I just threw a random tomahawk in the air and I killed a machinima director and he posted that video on machinima and you guys you know watched it and thought it was fun to watch and I'm glad that you guys watched it so and now I got you know, some subscribers and I'm having a good time posting on YouTube for you guys, making montages and stuff, so, but yeah, so that's what I mostly did for YouTube, and, you know, I'm just having a good time with it, and I just want to make montages and stuff, and, well, mostly sniping montages, because that's what I enjoy the most, but, so that's just a little bit about me, and this game's wrapping up soon. Um, I think I pick up the Scorcher, and I actually I do kill this last guy with the Scorcher too. So in both rounds, I do get the final last two kills. But the way I kill this guy, I just I because there's the execution, so I just bust this guy's head. Um, thanks for listening to me, and you know, I'm just excited that it's my first commentary, and I'm excited to be beating the crap on this guy's head. And thank you so much um, for subscribing. I hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday. Um, I'm gonna hit the grind again and start doing some more work, so thank you.